With technology booming over the last 20 years, the world is a completely different planet. Technology has the ability to take us forward as humans or it has the potential to destroy us. In this video, we discuss the threat of a complete financial crash and if new technology called blockchain can reinvent the world as we know it. If this is your first time on the channel or you have returned and enjoy the content, then can you please like, share and subscribe. It really does help me and the channel. Oh yeah, and don't forget to press the bell icon so you never miss out on upcoming videos. And if you are interested in cryptocurrency, check out the link in the description box below. Virtually all economies in the world are suffering due to having too much debt. There are lots of different factors that the financial experts will come up with, but you don't have to be a financial guru to know that a system that relies on continual growth is unsustainable. Southeast Asian countries are no different and are very vulnerable to a complete financial crash. On top of already having too much debt, enter the coronavirus. The COVID-19 virus is almost the straw that breaks the camel's back. With tourism being a major player in the economy of most Southeast Asian countries and crucial to local businesses, this is a devastating time for all. What most Western countries are doing is printing money and basically handing it to the people affected. In essence, what money printing is doing is bailing out the banks and financial institutions to keep the system going. On face value, it may seem a logical way to keep businesses afloat and keep people in work, but you can't keep printing money forever. It will create hyperinflation and will eventually destroy currencies. The US dollar is the world's currency and has been for quite a while, but the US is the most indebted country in the world and are trillions of dollars in debt. On top of that, the current establishment are trying to impose their will on other countries financially, which is having a detrimental effect on the stabilisation of peace on earth. What will happen if there is a complete collapse of the world's financial system? Imagine a breakdown of the food chain and a society as we know it. In my opinion, it may lead to a world war, or at the very least, anarchy. What if there was a new technology that could revolutionise the financial system? Is blockchain the answer? What is blockchain technology? Blockchain technology is a structure that stores transaction records, also known as the block, of the public in several databases, known as the chain, in a network connected through peer-to-peer -peer nodes. Now, to most of you, that probably sounds very complicated, but basically what it means is blockchain is a system of recording information in a way that makes it difficult or impossible to change, hack or cheat the system. For example, when you want to buy something online or send money to someone overseas, you make a transaction which will go through a third party, the banks. With today's technology and the ability of hackers, your information is at risk and the fact that the banks will make money from your transaction and the second party will not receive the money for a period of time makes this system almost obsolete. Now, imagine there is a system where you can send information and money securely and safely without the risk of being hacked or having to go through the banks to make transactions. Every transaction is peer-to-peer. You are essentially your own bank. Imagine everyone having total control of their own money. What would the roles of the banks be then? One thing for sure is, they would not have control of the people or governments. That is blockchain. The financial part of blockchain is called cryptocurrency. What is cryptocurrency? The most well-known and successful crypto is called Bitcoin. There are also numerous cryptos called altcoins. It's a very technical process, but basically involves what's called cryptocurrency mining and is when a computer is used to solve a cryptographic puzzle in order to build blocks. The process concludes when miners are rewarded with cryptocurrency. It's difficult to fully explain what blockchain, cryptocurrency and Bitcoin is in a short video, but there is so much information online and I suggest researching to get a grip on this technology. Google is your best friend in research. To give you an example of how profitable Bitcoin has been to those who embraced this financial technology at its beginning, when it was developed in 2009, 
you could buy one Bitcoin for 0.03 US dollars. Considering the price of one Bitcoin today in 2020 is over 10,000 US dollars, the early investors of this technology made a very sound financial investment. There are many in the financial industry who are convinced that cryptocurrency is the future of the financial system and that the price of one Bitcoin may go up to as much as 100 to 400,000 US dollars. So, what is the future going to be like in Southeast Asia? Will countries be able to survive financially and get back to normal once the COVID-19 pandemic passes? Will the financial system be able to cope? Cryptocurrencies may just be the saviour for us all. What are your thoughts? Comment below.